Hey there, wanted to give you a quick overview of some of the new stuff we've got going on in Show 1 version 1.3.4. We completely updated the user interface and just tried to make it a better experience overall. We reorganized some things and hopefully made things clearer and easier to use for people. As you can see, the home screen is all new. You've got your tracks and your sets there as before, but with descriptive buttons that help you get to where you want to go. The store is now known as the shop, and we'll get to that in a second. And you've got your global settings there. So if we go to tracks, we've totally redesigned this page as well. Same as before, you can go into a track settings by pressing the little I edit button on the right there. And here in settings, we've revised this as well. And they're in sub menus now. So for instance, in click options here, you've got all the click related settings for that track, such as click delay, click mute, an accented click and the tempo pitch and bar counter information is now always there at the ready in the transport to make it easier to edit your tracks going back to the track screen here you can see that track import is now within this section so if you want to import new tracks you can do it from here you hit import and much like before you've got your import queue here and the plus symbol in the upper right will allow you to import tracks from the various cloud sources. Coming back to the home page here, we'll take a look at the sets area. We'll go into a set here, we'll take the practice set. And as you can see, it's similar, but the main difference is to go into show view, you used to have to swipe up from the transport area. It was a little hard for people to see or know that they could even do that. So we've added this little arrow in the bottom right there and you just press that and boom, you're in show view, which gives you bigger text, a little easier on the eyes in a live performing scenario. And then to go back into set view, you hit the arrow in the upper right corner there. And now you can you know, edit your tracks from here, just like in the track screen, rearrange the set with your edit button right here, move things around like this, or tell tracks to play into the next one with the playthrough and save it. So that's similar, but uh, with just a different interface. And back at the home page here, let's take a look at the shop. This used to be called the store, now it's called the shop. And here, the main thing is the what we now call the basic version of Show 1, which used to be known as Unlocking Show 1. Picking up the basic version allows you to import as many audio files as you want and it gives you more click sounds and allows you to access the advanced features which currently are the four channel mode and midi transport more of those will be coming soon and finally in the overall settings page much like track settings we've reorganized and clarified this put things into sub menus making it easier to see where you are. We've also made the preview button much clearer and if you push that it'll play the last played track so you can go in and adjust your click levels and your other levels, the cue pan, left to right and various settings while the track is playing. And that's show one, 1.3.4. Hope you like it. Let us know what you think. Any feature requests you have, we've got a lot more coming in the next few months. And of course, if you have any problems, you can hit us up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or the website, showoneapp.com. Thanks a lot.